Asus has just unveiled its 2021 ZenBook series laptops including the Asus ZenBook Flip, the Asus ZenBook OLED, the Asus ZenBook Pro Duo 15 OLED and the one that I have right here, the Asus ZenBook Duo 14. Thanks to the folks from Asus Malaysia for sending these units over. Delay no more, let's unbox and see what it has to offer. Here's the box of the Asus ZenBook Duo 14 UX482, the successor of the UX481. It comes with a sleeve case, a slim foldable stand for the laptops, some documents, Asus Pen, and a 65W USB-C PD adapter. Here are a few new updates compared to the previous models. First, the ZenBook Duo 14 now gets a tilting 12.6 inch screen pad plus design. The secondary display tilts upwards by 7 degrees to reduce glares and reflections. At the same time, it increases the overall cooling airflow. I can further tilt up the display with the given foldable stand that provided inside the box. Beside that, it supports USB-C power delivery charging and you can charge the laptops with any GAN certified chargers and even power banks. The ASUS ZenBook Duo 14 is not an average laptop that you see in the market. It comes with two displays, a 14-inch Full HD with 100% sRGB color gamuts and Pantone Validate certifications. It features Nano Edge display with over 93% screen to body ratio. The secondary display is a 12.6-inch touch display with ASUS Core Screen Pad Plus. Both displays also support the latest 1496 pressure level active stylus pens, the ASUS Pen, which included in the box. There are a few news and updated built-in apps on the Screen Expert 2 software to help boost productivity. The model that I have here is powered by Intel Core i7 1165G7, 32GB of LPDDR4 RAMs, Intel Iris Xe graphics, 1TB NVMe SSD storage, Intel Wi-Fi 6 and Bluetooth 5.0. Port-wise, on the left side there are two Thunderbolt 4 that support up to 40 gigabit per second data transfers and even can connect up to two external 4K displays and a HDMI 2.1 port. While on the right side there is a USB Type A 3.1 Gen 2, audio combo port and a micro SD card reader. There's also an IR webcam with Windows Hello support. Due to limited space on these laptops, the keyboard and touchpad have to move next to each other at the bottoms. There isn't any palm rest space available and I need some time to readjust on using the keyboards and the narrow track packs on these laptops. The keyboard is tactile and comes with pre-level backlight brightness. There are two down firing speakers tuned by Harman Kardon located at the bottoms of the laptops. Having two displays on the laptop does add advantage. It opens up a whole new levels of productivity with multi-screen for faster workflows. It's also great for content creators and even professional photos and video editors who need a portable rig. Of course, there are some compromise of having two displays on a laptop. First, you lost some ergonomics as there are no space for your pump. Secondly, it's thicker and heavier compared to other 14-inch ASUS ZenBooks. I'll have a more comprehensive written reviews very soon and you may find the link in the description box below. So what's your thought of having dual displays on a laptop? To share a comment in the comment box below. If you have any questions regarding to these laptops, don't be shy to slide me a DM on my socials. If you are new here, my name is Joshua Wong, a small content creator from Malaysia. I do a lot of how-to, text unboxings and reviews on these channels. And if this is your kind of stuff, do consider to subscribe. I hope to see you guys in the next one.